What's up, people? This your boy Big Vic. I'm back in the building with a quick video in reference to re-drum. I had somebody ask me, how do you go in here and route the re-drum to individual mix channels on the SSL mixer? So what you want to do is you want to hit that tab button on your computer, keyboard, Turn this bad boy over right here. You see these individual outs. And you want to go in here and create. Hit that. For me, I'm hitting control. Or it might be shift on yours. But I'm hitting control. Create. You want to create a new. Where we at? Where we at? We want to create a new mix channel. Let's see. Where is it at? Uh, go ahead and raising devices, create new mix channel, right? Boom, like that there. It just created a new mix channel up here. You see it highlighted it right there. So what I would do is take the redrum and yours is going to be connected through the stereo outputs which is running every every one of these channels or tracks is running through the stereo output up here, right? Which is only coming through one mix channel. So to get a better mix and control of your redrum and to separate all of these sounds individually on the individual um <clears throat> Mix channels up here. You want to take this one here, right? Exactly where I have it at. Go in here to this output. Excuse me. This input. Right? Take that. Bring it down here. Actually, that output, we're going into the input here into that mix channel right boom so we flip it back around check out the, the mixer, mixer up top, top. Boom. boom and you want to do, do the same, same thing, thing for each one of these create a new mixer channel for all 10 outputs depending on how many you're using um and go back and put go down here to the inputs for each channel. As you can see, all the mods are doing the same thing. Individual channels. Then you can have control over all of your sounds. So you won't just get you won't have a muddy a muddy sound. Everything will be stretched out individually over these channels right here, these mix channels. So you should be sounding like this. Right? Now you got full control. So now you can go ahead and individually put all any effects that you want on those channels. Get you a nice sweet starter mix. But that's how you do that for those that are just starting out on reason. Um it's pretty simple. Uh, and that's how you do that. This is going to be it for this video. I'll check you on the next video. It's your boy Big Vic. Hope this helped you. Give me the thumbs up if you like the video. If it's going to help you out. Peace.